subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Johnny Depp has been hit by a slew of further allegations, including that he had someone feed him lines through an earpiece while he was acting, as a legal battle with his former managers descended to a new level of acrimony. The former managers also suggested that Depp may suffer from compulsive spending disorder which they hope to prove through a mental examination of their former client. They also claimed that Depp's sense of entitlement is clear and epic. In January the Pirates of the Caribbean star sued the management group, his former financial managers, for fraud. The company then countersued and accused Depp of profligate spending. It was claimed that he spent $75 million on 14 homes, including a French chateau and a chain of islands in the Bahamas, $30,000 a month on wine, that he bought 45 cars, and spent $3 million on a large cannon from which the ashes of author Hunter S. Thompson were fired. In the latest court complaint filed in Los Angeles the ex-managers claimed Depp was fed his lines for years by a sound engineer who was paid hundreds of thousands of dollars. Lawyer Michael Kump, their lawyer, wrote, Depp insisted that this sound engineer be kept on yearly retainers so that he no longer had to memorize his lines. Mr. Kump wrote, Depp's extravagant spending has often been marked by a lack of impulse control. In retrospect, it appears that Depp may suffer from a compulsive spending disorder, which will be proven in this action through a mental examination of Depp and expert testimony. On information and belief Depp's flagrant bragging about his senseless and extreme spending to the Wall Street Journal is further evidence of his psychological issues. The complaint also alleged that Depp employed an army of attorneys which had been used to make a series of hush money settlements and it was claimed details of those payments would be revealed if there was a trial. In a statement, not filed in court, Depp's lawyer Adam Waldman described the